One second. Let me get the intro beginning. Uh, shout out to anyone that subbed recently. Hey guys, how you doing? Uh, I know I do this intro pretty often, but welcome back to my VIRD video series where I basically upload about my server. Oh, so it's spooky season. Woo, spooky. Last video I showed off my skin, which had this unique look of spooky head. I am like my brethren. Okay, now listen to me on clear. I, my editors are out of town. My editors are out of town for the last couple days. And for the last couple days, I've been working on my server nonstop. So, in return, I want to show you guys a massive update that I have done. And in return, if you like these videos, smash that like button. And, uh, okay, let, let me get up to my house. I have something for like a stupid skit. I have, um, let's see, let me get there smash that sub button and don't forget to smash the like button I don't button but also hit that bell button for notifications it does update you on every time a video uploads so just know that I work really hard on these updates so let's kind of begin with the town area now I'm at first you might be thinking Kevin there is no unique difference. So we're going to start off on the smallest update and then head off to the biggest ones. The first small update will be in the small cavern underneath here. Now last video, if you watched it, um, there was an active portal. An illegal nether portal that was active in the area. You guys ready for seeing this? You guys ready? I don't think you guys are ready for this. Let's do this. You ready? Bam! The portal malfunctioned and destroyed itself look at it the entire portal broke and now it's in ruins you can all notice that the gate also broke as well and the entire lower <laughs> thank you for dying okay basically the entire portal is broken and yes this is going to be a story lore thing so yeah it looks pretty cool also if you notice the iron is still here because well logic okay so that's one small update there's about three small updates a bigger update and the biggest update the next smaller update will be actually somewhere around here because you notice that there's a lot of small updates and this small update will be right here actually if you don't know i've been watching a lot of the new the new crash bandicoot game you know and i was thinking wow I want a reference to that game, because holy shit, it's a fun game. whoop de doo I built, I said whoop de doo on occasionally, kill me now. Okay, what I can say is I built this. This entire bridge is supposed to represent the Crash Bandicoot style, and I like it. Can I, would I build more like this structure? Yes. Will I do it later on? I don't know, maybe. Um, but yeah, also there's another update where I actually did update date some smaller things on this map that being adding pumpkins to a new area and um updating the build that i have not touched in months so i finally built this thing this is a small update i don't i have no clue what i'm gonna do with this please tell me in the comments what this should be um so yeah the next thing i want to talk about is gonna make you guys really happy you guys are going to like this. Um, so remember how I said last video about the winter wastelands and everything else? Well, there's a tiny update that happened. And you guys are going to like it. So whenever you come by here, you're going to notice that there is a frozen wasteland here. But this is different. There is no frozen wasteland. It's full of grass, overgrown weeds, and the portal is destroyed. Jesus Christ, the portal's actually destroyed. Yeah, I basically moved the Winter Wastelands from one small area to its own original location. Which will be pretty much located, I'll show you later on after this. As well as all this, I removed some of the wall surface buildings here, like the walls here, so you can basically walk through easier. And 
yeah that's it now the next thing i did was there is some smaller updates around the map but it's not here i i'm gonna show you guys right now you guys can probably see it right behind me but all the walls that kept a reference between the swamp and the normal village area are gone every single wall is gone and this is what I want to do. In return, I basically built a small neighborhood-like design in the swamp. And this looks really cool. Like, you have this building here, which looks really nice. Like, all the builds here are supposed to represent, like, a swamp-like design. So, you have, like, the cobblestone and mossy. You have the fence-like walls and windows. And it looks really neat, in my opinion. Did I waste my time doing this? Yes. Was it worth it to make an entire area just depend on this? Yes, it was. Because in the very end, when I released the map, I want you guys to feel like you're not kind of honed into one area, but you're able to enter an open building site. So I did that. I hope you guys like this because this is how much work that was done. All those walls took forever to destroy. <laughs> Now, as well as all this, there's a bunch of other smaller updates, but yeah, one of the smaller updates around here too is I got rid of the wall here as well and opened up here. So now instead of having this massive crater, like I said last video, now you have this witch's hut, which I think it's a witch's hut. I'm not even sure. Hold on. Yeah, this is a witch's hut and you have down here... This really neat canopy, which in the very end, using chains, it looks really cool. And wow, I'm overhyping this, aren't I? Screw it. Also, Karen's house is no longer here, so I want to rebuild the entire structure and make this happen. So yeah, this is your own personal movie theater. Welcome. Okay, so in the very end, that's all the updates I have for that area. But... We aren't even close to the beginning of this. Now, last video, I didn't check the comments, which I probably should. Um, I'm going to check them right now on video and see who won the comment section. Um, let's check on... There are no comments. So, I'm going to say it's a tie. Now, for this video, I want to ask you. What do you like better, redstone ore or nether gold? Tell me in the comments. Um, the winner will actually get a unique update. Okay, fair enough. <clears throat> Sorry, I just, my throat hurts. Now, the next thing I want to show you is here. Now, in return, there's nothing new here. You've seen this all once before. Every video, rip Rick May, man, he is a good person. You, you, this, let's just... Yeah, rip, 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 rip me. Okay, now, but if you notice, there is no wall in this area anymore, and it's a lot more opened. Like I said, I've been getting rid of a lot of the random stupid walls that existed just so I can explore and open up the area. It's the winter wasteland. That's the update. Okay, um, now in continuation, you might be thinking, Kevin. What is this hat? What happened here? There used to be a massive entrance where you could go to this area. Well, I thought it was wasteful, wasted and useless because you can't really enter it because you really just can't. So in return, I extended the railway system, went deep underground, and here is the first clue that you're going to the winter wasteland. The entire cave down here is covered in snow and ice and with this when you exit you are now thank you basically now you are in the winter wasteland now i think you guys saw in the distance but this is the winter wasteland it's a bit of a small build but over time it'll get bigger now, let me show it off a bit, actually, because holy crap, this thing took me so long to build. Now, first off, the Winter Wasteland, I rebuilt the portal, you know, the beautiful blue one. 
and I started doing some interior work. Now, in return, why is there snow in here? Yeah, in return, there's a lot of things to be said, but in general, it's just aesthetic. You have the blue soul lanterns, the frozen ice, those freezing snow, but why do I get fences? Dead trees, well, they're not dead, they're kind of like in hibernation. And amazingly beautiful houses, which are definitely cheap builds, because I don't know what else to add. Yeah, as well as all this, you have the frozen lake from the Christmas update a year ago, which... And, and still, I still love that update nevertheless. And you have the soul campfires and an igloo. Y yes, it's an igloo. What do you want me to say? Okay? So, yeah. That's the winter wasteland. And at the very most, you probably think, Kevin, is that all? No, it's not. It is not all. Also, don't... This is for, for, for future updates, so don't worry. Um... The next update is here, and this is a smaller update, but I want to do it for the new Caves and Cliffs update. If you don't know what that is, that's the update coming up, but um, I want to prepare for this and create, oh my god, I hit the wrong button, its own location. Oh, I gotta fix this, don't I? There we go. Okay, basically, my idea was I wanted to create and fix up this entire cavern. So the once destroyed ruins, are repaired again huzzah <laughs> my brain hurts kill me now okay so basically when you crawl through here it no longer looks like a ruin it looks pretty good but hold on there's a stairway here where does it go Ooh, i can see from a distance it goes down somewhere okay let me go down and explain the vines are creeping down slowly the vines are slowly creeping down, and that's the coolest looking part. Now, in return, this enters into a new cave system that I recently built just for the new Caves and Cliffs update. This update won't happen until that day, so just remember that this update area exists, because when that update does happen, it's going to be so cool, because now we're going to have a crap ton of new stuff. So, yeah. That's all the updates. This was a massive update day because I had no idea how I was going to do this. Now, if I did skip over some smaller updates, that's perfectly fine. Because, also, uh, if you didn't know about what happened last video, um, the spooky haunted house is now open. Which means, on my server. Okay, so... I mixed up my words, and I'm sorry if I did, but now I'm going to end this video. So, um, okay, so I'm going to, okay, so the video is over. Now, the video has ended, and I hope you guys like this video. Next update will be in the desert. You can do whatever you want on this server. And, um, yeah, so this server won't be the updated version of the server you're going to see on that map because it's going to be the old version. But I'm going to update the map today after this video so you guys can enjoy the new map when it comes out and you could join me on the tour. Now what is the tour? The tour is going to be on an alternate server that I also own. So I'm going to copy the map and basically upload that map, this map, onto that old server. And what I'm going to do is on, let me figure out a date real quickly. And on Friday the 9th, okay, write this down, write this down. On Friday the 9th, you guys will get to join me on that server. Yeah, basically, I'm going to make a whole video and um, I'm going to be talking to you guys via my Discord. So... I'll put the, my server link for the server I'm going to be using in the description as well as the serve as well as my Discord. And if you guys have a voice, you guys can join that voice chat and you can join me in the video. Also, if you like this video, smash that like button. Don't forget smash the like button, subscribe and notifications on. Um hopefully you guys understand this that it took me so long to do this update and if you liked it all, um please make sure to Tell me in the comments. Also, redstone or nether gold? Tell me in the comments down below. The winner will get a secret 
spooky secret update. Woo! Because everybody knows I love updates. So, I'm end the video here. Uh, if you enjoyed this, smash the like button. Notifications on. All the other stuff will be linked in the description. My Discord and the server will be linked in the description. I will open it periodically and you guys can hop in and do whatever the hell you want with it. Now, be yet. Hope you guys like this video and I'll see you next video. Peace out. And I'm going to have to end the video by lowering the screen and ending the video here. This is 15 minutes. Wow. Um, I guess I should probably lower this to 16. What do I talk about? Oh, I know. Um, also, I might be giving away Nitro Discord. I have free Nitro on my Discord account. Just uh, tell me what you think. Basically, I'm going to say a riddle now. Or not a riddle. I'm going to say something. And if you can remember from next. And if you put in the first person in the comment section. That joins my Discord. Um, we'll get Nitro. Okay? Cool. You ready for this? Peanut butter. That's it. Now. In the end. You have to tell me. You have to. At the end. Tell me. When I said it. And show me evidence that you're the first person to do it so that I know I can give you Discord Nitro. Okay? Cool. I'm ending the video now. Have a wonderful day, guys. Uh, this update took me way too long, and I think I spent way too much time thinking about it. Peace out, guys.